when you're using right pad as a click for interact or whatever, as we're stroking, having a seizure, as I'm as I click in, there's a little bit of a you know, it's just as my thumb moves. There's a little bit of a mouse cursor jitter, which I might not want. And that is super simple to <laughs> rectify. Just gives you a little bit more control. So what I have going on is on my click. Actually, no, let me back up. Because this is kind of a direct contradiction of previous tutorial I did where I was going on and on about how double tap the double tap binding on the right pad, how I use that in almost every profile I make. And then here I am making a profile where I can't use it. So I can't use the double tap because I am doing edge taps. And so I have like jump, jump, uh, let's go up, roll, roll, you know, down. I wanted to put all the control, all the uh, flight con maneuvering. So because I'm doing that, I'm using Menence, I believe he was the bad boy who came up with that. I'm using his method where, you know, an inner ring on this default pad takes me to my modified mouse layer, which works. You just can't do the double tap. So because of that, I was noticing that I'm using instead of my double tap, which I would normally use for interact, I was using click, and I was noticing that jitter a little bit more. So, okay, context, backstory, let's move ahead. How to get rid of that jitter? Super easy. So first for the gyro, I just did a mode shift on that right pad click. I just, I had to bind something. It wasn't, if I just do none, it was just defaulting back to the, uh, mouse. Or actually, you know what? We could keep it as the mouse on a right pad click. Yeah. Why do not I, yeah, that's easier. See, I'm learning something. On a right pad click, turn the gyro off. There, you can see I'm... Flicking gyro all over the place. I'm not, not moving. Now I'm still moving because it's that. As I'm holding this in, my thumb is still moving around a little bit. So gyro is off. But we also want to turn the mouse off. And for that, all I did was do a mode shift on right pad click, turn it into a single button so there's no mouse input, and then just have it be my interact. So now I click in, moving around, moving gyro, nothing. Moving his, nothing. So it just keeps it, you know, wherever I'm looking, I click. Holding it, it's in there. There's no jitter at all. Hey, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Yeah, and there it is, nice. Ugh. <laughs> shake, 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 shake. Yeah. So now there's no, like, jitter all around because, which I was also noticing it in this profile because I don't want to have trackball mode because I want it to be responsive to these edge tabs. So I have my mouse pad a little bit more sensitive than I would normally. So I was just noticing, you know, like the, which I could try to mitigate with minimum threshold, but, eh, 